we think this tidal wave is coming. We want to be in front of the tidal wave. I think the tidal wave is going to hit faster and harder than basically everyone realizes. And we want to make sure we're on the other side of it. And so we think it's going to require some different people with a different mindset to do what we want to do. And yeah, you mentioned like your job is going to be primarily managing a bunch of AI interns to get work done rather than necessarily doing it yourself. And we're seeing this, especially right now with code. If you're someone who is using like the cursor agent mode, like, you know, a good software engineer right now is going to have at least one agent running all the time doing something, right? They start the agent off and then they go start working on the next problem and it goes off and solves it. And like, we have found that it's possible right now. You can take a bug report from Asana. We can copy it verbatim into that agent mode and ask it and it'll solve it in one shot in many cases, which is pretty amazing. So on the software engineering side, it's like, we're looking for people whose skill set is primarily not execution, it's not writing code, it's primarily understanding the problems, understanding the components involved and how they should interact and being able to like frame those prompts. And so the value has shifted from people who can get things done to people who can understand the problems and structure things. On the design side, I think it's changed too, where it used to be that the way that you design a product is like, you know, you get together in a room and on a whiteboard and you draw it out and then you make some mocks and then you make a prototype and then you build a thing. And now the first thing you do is make a prototype, right? Like before I even talk to anyone else, I just build it in bolt.new. And it's only after I'm like, yeah, I think this will be pretty good. Then I go and I talk to the right people and we like make a mock and we try to figure out the details, but it lets us kind of cycle through bad ideas like much, much faster. So we're looking for designers who have already made the shift of, I don't start with a mock, right? I don't even start with a wireframe. I start with a working version that I have built with Bolt.new or a tool like that. That's the beginning. Same thing with, with like content, ChatGPT 4.5. It's really good at writing, right? And I can produce, you know, content that's at a pretty high bar in a fraction of the time. And so we want people who are good at, you know, how can one person manage our blog, our social media, our change log, all the docs on our website, everything. How could just one person do this if they're thinking hard about the right prompts and the right way to use these tools and have it generate this stuff? So it's gone from, hey, maybe we need a team of 50 to do this to maybe we just need a team of like 15 or 20 people with like the right skill set and the right usage of these tools. And, you know, the 30 people that aren't there anymore are really more on the execution side and the 15 or 20 there are really more on the sort of like problem understanding and solving side. And... I think it's going to be a big shift. And, and we actually let a couple of people go who were really very talented, very good at what they did, great employees, great attitude, but not quite right for this, this new world that we felt we need to get into and not super, super passionate about it either. And so we thought a change needed to be made. 